Hi, I'm James, or Jim 2.0. I'm going to give a brief rundown of the screenshot I did for The Witcher 3. I like this one in particular because I feel like it's sort of the more interesting and unique compositions that I've come up with, and I'm always happy when I can think of something original, as creativity isn't really my strong suit. I remember I was exploring this section of the map, and I originally thought about doing an action shot with these harpies that I saw flying around. But in the process of watching them, I thought it might be more interesting to have Geralt standing off from a distance watching them similar to how I was. I think it just made for a more interesting idea. Perhaps he's planning an attack or just admiring their magnificent flight patterns. As for the technical details, I captured this back in 2020, so it was before the next-gen version which had a photo mode. I had to use a free cam mod as well as Cheat Engine to get enough control over the game to capture shots like this. Someone made a script for Cheat Engine that would allow you to freeze and unfreeze enemy animation speeds. This is useful for action shots because you can individually freeze Geralt and enemies, which will allow you to get the poses just right. Once I got the harpies positioned where I wanted them, I put Geralt on that rock facing the same direction to give a nice flow to the scene. Before I paused Geralt, I did a little trick where I had him facing the opposite direction, and then did a quick 180 degree spin. That would cause his cape to whip around, and then as it settled, I would freeze it, which would give his cape the sort of illusion that it was blowing in the wind. It takes a couple times to get right, but I always think it's worth doing to give an otherwise static pose some movement. Then I used a time of day script to adjust the sun position so that Geralt and the harpies would be nicely silhouetted against the background. The only other thing to note is that there's these cliffs in a distant background, and I kind of wanted to have Geralt lined up just between them. I always want the subject to be clearly visible and not blend in with the background too much. I remember when I put this up on Twitter, I posted it with a set of other shots, and the quest director for CD Projekt Red, Powell Sasko, said it was his favorite set of shots. But um, the other ones weren't all that special, so I'm pretty sure that this was the one that he liked specifically. That's pretty much it. Thanks for listening, and thanks, Shinobi, for having me.